Okay, good morning. Welcome to Explorex Caravans. This morning I'm going to be showcasing our latest model, a Tandem Axle Kimberley model, which will be part of our new adventure series. Now this particular caravan was a complete custom build, and as you can see, it's significantly narrower than our other caravans, and it is built on a tandem axle instead of a single axle. So as we start up the front here, it's got a uh, DO35 off-road hitch, stone guard, twin gas balls, twin jerry can holders, and a large front toolbox, plenty of storage there, and it's uh, seals to keep the red dirt out. It's also got a um, barbecue slide. Now that will fit a Weber Q. As we look down the side, we've got the scrub bars, full checker plate. And one thing you'll notice about this van is it's got a very high ride height. So you've got a great amount of clearance there to get you into some uh, tricky places. It's the tandem axle. As we walk down the back here, it's got an auxiliary shower. Uh, the two water fillers. Now this customer actually optioned for four onboard water tanks uh, which has a combined leachage of 328 litres which is a lot of water so that'll keep you going for a while. It's got a hot water system and the uh, toilet there. Rear bumper bar, twin spares so there's got 16 inch rims on uh, all-terrain tyres. As we come around the front here it's got a full awning with a fully enclosed annex as well. I'll just show you underneath. So underneath here we've got the Cruise Master XT fully independent coil spring suspension, each with dual shock absorbers, and that's got 12 inch off-road electric brakes. So you see the tandem axle again. And at the front here we've got a very large um, tunnel boot. Store lots in there. Let's have a look inside. Immediately as you walk in, the first thing you'll notice about this fan is it's got a uh, east-west bed instead of the north-south, which is more common. Now that's because this particular customer optioned for the uh, east-west bed, but we can build it with the north-south. It's got a little uh, nook in there to store things. Uh, 12 volt lighting. All of the lighting in this fan is 12 volt, runs off the battery. It's got a, a 12 volt TV too, so you can even watch TV when you're uh, not on mains power. Got a full kitchen, three burner stove, uh, sink with a water filter tap. Got a microwave. And we've also got plenty of storage up above and down below as well. Now this customer optioned for their hot, their um, washing machine, sorry, to be put in here instead of in the um, bathroom. Sort of uh, hidden away nicely there. As we look, we've got a uh, full leather dinette with a bifold table, uh, 240 outlet here, and 12. And these are throughout the whole van, and it's got a cigarette socket and the two USBs, which allows you to power your phone, your tablet um, when you're out in the bush, not on mains power. Down here, I'll show you. We've got a 140 litre two door fridge which will run off 12 or 240 volt. And up here, we've got our control center. Now, this tells us how much water's in the tanks. This customer optioned for the uh, EnerDrive uh, power inverter, and what that does is that allows um, all the 240 volt outlets to work when you're not plugged to power, it runs off the batteries. So you can power the microwave, the air conditioning, and any other accessory you have that runs off uh, 240 when you're out in the bush. It's also got an ePro um, solar and battery monitor. Uh, we've got a CD, DVD player, and our Explorex in-house um, 12 volt circuit breakers and all our electrical here. Around more storage up here. Magazine holders, and then I'll just show you the uh, full on suite. So we've got uh, vanity there, um, plenty of storage, toilet, more storage up there, and then I'll just turn around here. And we've also got a full height shower. So, full height shower, and we've got nice closing door. 
this customer also optioned for the um, diesel heater. Now what that does is that when you're out somewhere in winter and it's very cold, you can fire this up and it'll warm this uh, area up very quickly. And obviously it doesn't draw any power off your batteries, it runs off diesel. It's also got a uh, fan. Now these little 12 volt fans come standard in all our caravans. And they're really great because when you're up north somewhere and it's really hot, uh, you can run these all day, all night, and they don't chew a lot of power out of your batteries. Speaking of, we've got two onboard batteries on this caravan and also it's got four on rooftop solar panels instead of uh, two. Again, this customer option for four. We've got our uh, wind-up antenna there as well. It's a really, uh, really great model. Certainly something a bit different. As we come out, so the tear weight of uh, this particular model is 2,500 kilos, with an ATM of uh, 3,500 kilos. Thousand kilos to play with. Up there. So, if you'd like any more information about this model or any of our other models, check out our website. The link will be in the description. If not, come down and have a look for yourself. Alright, thanks. Have a good day.